Hey, before this video starts, I just want to say, if you like this content, make sure to like and subscribe to my channel. Also, if you want a video of your own, make sure to commission me either when I'm live on YouTube or you can DM me through my public Discord server. Anyway, let me not take up your time. Enjoy the video. Well, look who finally came around to make their grand entrance. <laughs> it's good to see you too, Hell's Wanderer. Where you been? I see, I see. You've been talking with the sins recently, huh? Mm-hmm. Which ones did you see this time? Oh, you saw Beelzebub, all right. And, uh, how was she? I know sometimes, from what I heard, she could be a little bit of a airhead, but also the life of the party. <laughs> yeah, I kind of knew that. She's always throwing parties. Her invitations go to all seven rings. She tries to get everybody to get the biggest party out there so she can get more honey for her collection. So she can have more power. That's how it works for her. More honey is made, more power she has. But hey, if it works, it works. You want a drink? All right. What's your fancy for tonight? Oh, I would go in a little hard for a starter. All right. Well, let's not get too messed up right now, because we still got that date we gotta go to down in the Lust Ring. Mm-hmm. Of course I didn't forget. Are you kidding? I wouldn't miss this for the world. Yeah, well, it's been quite a long time since I've actually gone on a proper date. So... Yeah, I'm not going to miss this. And I'm going to be drinking as well, so... Fuck it. Let me take a shot with you. To tonight. Having a great time. Strong ass tequila, let me tell you. <laughs> but it's always nice to see you around here. I know you're always busy talking to all the big shots all up in hell and whatnot. Always talking to Lucifer, because, well, you're the one that's helping him out the most, besides Charlie, Vaggy, everybody else. You're the one out there that's actually helping him. Like setting up meetings with his dad and getting in contact with his dad. And by the looks of his face every time he sees you, he appreciates you. Appreciates you very deeply. And I think I could speak for everyone here. And we all appreciate you, Hells Wanderer. We all deeply appreciate you. Even sometimes if you're not around, or even just doing your own thing, you're always in our minds. So again, thank you. From me, from everyone, thank you. Uh, 
And, uh, I talked to Lucifer for a little second, and, uh, I managed to actually get into contact with Osmodius as well. I pulled a few strings, and, well, I talked to Lucifer, and... I eventually talked him enough to get VIP tickets to the House of Osmodius. He said he had a couple more tickets that he accidentally paid for, but he's the king of hell, so spending a few thousand dollars like that, I don't think it's going to hurt his pockets. <laughs> so I have two VIP tickets to the House of Osmodius for you and I tonight. Mm hmm. Oh, yeah, it's a real great seat. One of the tables up in the front row. You'll be able to see Osmodius and all his dancers and performers. Basically, right up in your face. Mm hmm. I've seen his shows that he's commercialized on the TV once or twice that look like. Really great shows. Although most of them are strippers. But hey, who gives a shit? <laughs> I guess the big old man himself is the main, like, show for the whole thing. And he's not that bad of a dancer. Yeah, from what I saw... On the TV. He's not bad at all. He knows how to work a pole. <laughs> you want another shot? Alright. I'm gonna cut you off at three shots because, you know, I still need you coherent while we're doing our date. And plus, there's going to be lots of more expensive and more strong drinks down at the Lustering. Mm hmm. All right, all right. Cheers. <sighs> I've never been a fan of tequila. Ugh. Send shivers down my spine. I'm more of a whiskey guy. <laughs> hmm? Yeah, what's up? Really? You have a date with Lucifer down in the Lost Ring? That's interesting. Like, is it just, like, a friend date or something like that? Or is it, like, something more that I don't really know about? It's a friend date. Okay, okay. The show is, uh, appreciation to you, I'm presuming. Yeah, all right, all right. That makes sense. That makes sense. You know, that's probably why he bought the extra tickets. Well, yeah, it was on accident, but, like, he probably was too excited and must have had a finger slip or something. Uh-huh, uh-huh. But, yeah, I hope that date for you actually goes pretty well, too. But don't drink too much, or you might end up with the king of hell back in his mansion, if you know what I'm trying to say there. <laughs> I'm fucking her with you. I'm fucking with you. All right. Uh, what time is it right now? Ten fifteen. Mm hmm. Well, I think the reservation for the show is around ten thirty. So, I think if we start heading out now, we'll be fine. And we'll be able to catch the show in no time. 
Mm-hmm. But uh, there is one problem. I basically spent all my money trying to restock the bar. And I don't really have a way to actually, you know, go down to the lust ring. So, if you can mind, Hell's Wanderer, could you use your uh, magic to open a portal down to the lust ring? <laughs> It'll make it a lot easier on us. All right. All right. Well, how about it? One more shot before we get going? Okay. Cheers. For one hell of a night we're about to have. <laughs> Let's get going. 